Do you look up at the moon and wonder how it gets all its different shapes and colors? Have you ever heard someone say that the moon is made of cheese? However, this comet myth is not true. Let's find out how the creatures were formed by doing this simple science project. Materials The first materials we need to prepare are three different sized objects. I'll use a small potato, a golf ball, and a tennis ball. Prepare a ruler to measure the length. Cardboard box, it should be larger than a shoe box. Flour to put in the card box. Cocoa powder. <coughs> Prepare a whiteboard or a paper to draw a data table. Write down three objects on the data table and write the results later. Preparation. First, use a ruler to measure the tomato. Second, measure the length of the tennis ball. Finally, measure the length of the golf ball. Write a measurement result to the data table. Experiment. Look at Bong Bong on the right corner. Let's put flour in the card box and put cocoa powder on it. Measure 50 cm drop an object. Drop the first object a tomato from the tide. Measure the diameter of the crater made by the tomato. Write the diameter of the crater on the board three times. Drop a second object and write the diameter of the crater on the board. Repeat two more time for the tennis ball. Drop the third object. Write the diameter of the crater on the board. Repeat two more times for the golf ball. Average. Read the three experiments, each for three objects, and wrote down the diameters. Get the average of the numbers from three results and write them down. This graph shows the result. Red is the tomato, orange is a golf ball, and green is the tennis ball. My final thoughts. First, I got to know that lunar creatures were created by meteorites. There was a mistake in my experiments where tomato made the creature larger than a golf ball. Anyway, bigger meteorites can create a larger creature. Yeah!